What up? I am super excited today. I am really excited. I picked up a great bunch of books today. I, I One of the books in here I've been searching for forever in high grade raw. And I got it today. And I got a good price on it too. So, this is going to be my comic haul video for this week or whatever. I think I'll post it today on Saturday or whatevs. So, we're going to just jump right into it. Okay? See? <laughs> okay. So, first up, I picked up a graded CBCS... Deja Thoris variant number one, 9.8, signed by Frank Cho. Now, this is gorgeous. Love it. Sorry, guys, I've already sold it, but I wanted to add it to this video because it is a pickup. Gold signature, 9.8. Dude, beautiful. This is beautiful, dude. I gotta tell ya, it's it! Okay, now, here come the books. So, I love this book. I, I had it when I was a kid, now I have it again. Pretty decent uh, copy. Wolverine number eight, John Buscema cover. If I recall right, that was a really fun read too. Um, and I think there's some other stuff on the back too that was really cool. That's a classic cover, and I love it. Yeah. Okay. Now. I, I come up. That's all I got to say. I came up, okay? A lot of these books are super scarce and sick, dude. I am so happy to be the proud owner of this book right here. Incredible Hulk. Number... 441 the pulp fiction homage cover dude that is sick dude she's like captain america pillow and like x-men blanky fantastic four thing lamp there's a punisher pillow i think it says hulk fiction the book she's reading dude that cover is so sick dude yeah I'm so happy to own this. And I've looked for it. Next up, this was just for fun. But it's Incredible Hulk number 46. The Apocalypse Now homage cover. Dude. Fire. Sick. Some of these will be available for sale. Some will not. And I will ship them out using Gemini comic book supply mailers. Everyone, I don't care where you buy or sell or auction or whatever, you use Gemini. They are the best. Yes, we are partners now. And yes, if you buy a bunch, go over there. Links in the description. Enter in economics. And it gives you 20% off. This is what I would this is what I would suggest. I usually get I got 200 mailers last time. And and with the coupon, you guys, you're gonna save a bunch. But I remember I think the price break at hundred is at a hundred mailers, and believe me, you'll go through them fast if this is what you do. It's like 49 cents a comic book mailer. Dude, you have to do that. Forty nine ninety five. I mean, I would say buy more, but with twenty percent off, you can't beat that. If you get the, a mailer in the sh comic book shop, it's going to cost you a dollar or two dollars or something. It's the best way to protect your books. Okay, here we go. Now I've been on the spawn kit, guys. I can't wait to show you. Well, spawn number sixteen, of course, is the uh, cameo appearance of the Redeemer. And I have just started to pick up spawns as many as I can. Not number ones either. I, I don't need number ones. 
but the keys and the rare low print ones. So also, I have the first full appearance of Redeemer right here. So, uh, you know, there's the cameo and the first full appearance. Now, I picked up this cover because it's sick! And that's the only reason. Spawn number 67. Now, I have to go through and rebag these and all that stuff. There's like a little hair or something on it. That is so sick! <laughs> Whatever. I'll take these down. But, of course, these are all Capullo McFarlane's, dude. They're sick. Okay, dude. This is sick, okay? This is low print. And pretty much, it's a low print. It's the first cover appearance of Archangel Spawn number 77. Sick, dude. That is sick. Dude, I swear to God, when I see Capullo McFarlane, I'm going to get him to sign these books. Because I have been getting some super sick rare ones. And that's one of them. Gorgeous. And, and you know what else? I got a low print, scarce copy of number 97. The Angela cover. Dude, that book is scarce, hard to find, low print. Damn, she looks good, dude. That That is a sick cover. So those, the, already, there's two super low print. The 97 is scarce. This one. What else do we got? I also got number 99, which is also a low print comic. Number 99 is a low print book. Pretty excited about that. I'm digging these spawns right now. I can't tell you. I don't know. Now, this is the first printing of Spawn 100. There you go. So, I got 99 and 100. Okay? And I'm just, whatever, dude, I'm picking them up. I'm picking them up. I am looking for the scarce low print ones, and I'm getting them. Um, that, that, that number 77 and 97, dude, fire. Okay. Moving on. I have three more books. The last book is going to be the one I've been looking for in high grade raw for a long time. We're going to go ahead and start with Silver Surfer number 35, the reintroduction of Thanos and Drax the Destroyer. There it is. I love that cover. I've got a couple of those now. And it's high grade. I can't wait to take them out and really look at them. And I love Ron Lim's stuff. And there it is. I also got number 46, which is the reintroduction of Warlock Gamora, Pip in the Soul World, Inside the Soul Gem. Key, sick. I'm stocking up on these because I'm speculating that they are going to be key. Coming soon. Coming soon, if not already key. But for the new movie and all that, like that. There you go. Okay, drum roll, please. I am so happy to have picked this up. I have looked and looked and looked, and it was always too expensive and pretty crappy copies. And I have found what I have been looking for and is not leaving my sight. Silver Surfer number 44, the first full appearance of the Infinity Gauntlet. God, it's taken me forever to get this book. When I was younger, when I was putting together runs and collections and selling them, I had five full runs of Silver Surfer. And, you know, you never think about it. And now, the 1988 or 87 run of Silver Surfer is a hot-ass collection. So I finally got my Infinity Gauntlet book. I'm so, so happy. You have no idea. And this book is super clean. I'm going to take another look at it. I'm probably going to do a press on it. And I'm probably going to get it graded and put away. Because this book is shit. So. 
you know, I do have another book that I picked up, and I haven't done it in a haul video yet, so I'm going to go ahead and show you. But that was the, the special one for me today. Let me grab the last one that's super rare since we're on this. Actually, I'll show you two more super rare ones I picked up before this pickup. <laughs> so it's up in this over here. Where are you? There it is. Okay. I'm going to put the Silver Surfer away. And I'm going to be a show off a little bit longer, okay? <laughs> so I also got a really low, scarce, low print Spawn 127, one of my favorite covers. Gorgeous 666, like, alley, like, assault corner book. I don't know. Love it. And to cap it off, one of the most rarest low print scarce books. And this is going into CGC. This is a 9.8. I've never seen one. I've had one, but I've never seen one this perfect. I've looked at it a million times. It is a 9.8 all day. Carnage Mind Bomb number one. Dude, that book is sick. Now, I should have ended with Infinity Gauntlet. But, dude, that book in the 9.8, it's over $300. All day long. Um, I can't remember what the Infinity Gauntlet's going for right now. But regardless, these are my sick yeah. pickups. Super awesome. I hope you guys enjoyed. Some of those will be available in my auction. And we will see you next time. See ya!